RockConnect provides smart home as a service solution for the insurance industry. They deliver branded smart home apps and widgets, which connect to the leading smart home brands and services without the need of selling hubs and devices. This allows insurance carriers to effortlessly be part of the digital home and benefit from improved customer relationships. Mitigated risk and great insights. Next on stage, Rock Connect. Good afternoon, everybody. Um, I may introduce Sebastian, our head of product, and my name is Marcus. I'm the CEO of Rock Connect. Um, we're talking about the superpower in the connected home, in the home insurance industry. We have seen in the past few years a lot of uh, engagement and adoption in the smart home. And it was mainly driven by Amazon and Google entering that space now, and especially the voice assistants. So we can say that the smart home arrived at the mass markets. So why do you care? We know that two good reasons. It's risk mitigation and customer engagement. But what are your strategies? We saw that basically three base strategies would work. First, you ignore it. Or at least, you know, because you're here, you observe it. Second, you can do affiliate marketing, which comes with the flaw. It is easy, but you're not in control of the customer, of the customer relationship, and also not of the data. So third, you could launch an own product. This is hard, and this is expensive. It's also not good. And you have a problem with your main risks, the water, the fire, and the burglary. Did you ever see a, a water sensor in action? This is like doing the unsexy and waiting for the unlikely. So not good for customer engagement. So there is another way. It is smart home as a service. We provide a solution where you can connect on top of sensors and cool products that are already present in the home and deliver a solution. Hence, deliver customer engagement and mitigate the risk. But out of the box, we come with a, a very interesting value proposition. First, it is the smart home scoring. It's like home telematics. Second, it is a value-centric approach because you wanna, don't want to forget that the home value is the most important uh, thing that you protect. And third, it's a marketplace that opens new revenue streams for you. Uh, also for data privacy, you know, we made sure that we can combine privacy with insights and predictive or preventive analytics. So enough talking. I would like to uh, start with the demo. And let me start it by voice, which is a big driver. Alexa. Google. Uh, Sebastian. Yeah. Please show us the app. Sure, Marcus. We can now see our smart home start screen with smart modes and a quick view to the home. Let's have a first look into our smart living score. We can access our smart living score and explore the risk categories water, fire, and protection based on risk factors, connected devices, and smart rules or settings. We also may consume risk education and mitigation right at our fingertips. We may have also access to properties legacy data, like property uh, details or floor plans, as well as basic information about the real estate market, offering information about the value, our equity, the surrounding neighborhood, and easy access to services. My insurance can offer an easy access to my policies, claims management, and data sharing options. My services and marketplace provide easy access to subscribed services like security, house, setting, uh, house sitting, or cleaning, as well as the offerings of value-added products, services, and projects, and to specific incentives and campaigns. But let's use our smart home now. First, the devices. We can simply access and control all our devices in a consistent and intuitive way, always following the logic of device overview, device details, and hello, okay, and advanced settings like smart rules, timers, and schedulers. In our sample home, we can see a variety of branded sensors and products, which typically can be present in a home. Now, since I intended to go 
um, to the business trip to, to Munich, I wanted to protect my house by activating um, a scheduler for my Philips Hue devices to act as a presence simulation. So what I do now is I select the according device, I go to scheduler, I create a new scheduler, I give it a name, I select the time when it should start, a duration, and I choose the according days, which is Wednesday and Thursday, apparently. And by this, I created a new scheduler for my Philips Hue, which is already active. So second, I want to show you rules. Our generic rule engine supports any kind of use case, which is presented to us in the form of easy-to-use templates, which does not require any programmatic skill. So let's activate a rule for our newly added water sensor, which has been a nice giveaway from our insurance carrier. To do that, I press the plus in the upper right corner, I select rule, the security category, and I choose the rule template to send a notification when water sensor detects water. So the only thing that I have to do now here is to choose the water sensor that this rule should work with, and that's it. It's really that easy. So I could add another rule here, but I want to continue with our history. Our smart home is reporting all events and alerts, and we have great insight into what is happening in our home and when. Of course, we can add new gateways, new devices, and rules at any time as we go on with our smart home. And we are enjoying the fact that the portfolio of compatible devices is constantly growing with the market, and that we are already supporting Amazon Alexa or Google Home. Now, let's go back to our quick view page. Our smart living score changed. So what happened? Just by adding these two convenient rules, we impacted our risk profile. The schedule for the Philips Hue improved our burglary protection, and the water sensor notification rule brought our water score from very good to excellent. This is actually very good news, and we are one step closer to cool new products and services, thanks to Rock Insurance. Thank you, Sebastian. Let me quickly wrap up uh, what we have seen. An easy way to enter the smart home space or the, uh, the connected home space is smart home as a service. It is simple, though comprehensive. It is low cost, and it comes uh, with a, it is scalable in a way. We are here, and uh, we would be ready to go the, your smart moves with you. Thank you so much. We have a booth outside. Thanks.